we as a whole know that Toby Keith was a mainstream country music force to be reckoned with in the 90s and early 2000s with smash hits like How Do You Like Me Now? Should Have Been a Cowboy, As Good As I Once Was, Beer For My Horses, Courtesy of the Red, White, and Blue, and so many more. I mean, come on, the person racked up 20 number one hits to demonstrate it. However, these days, Toby is simply getting back into music after battling stomach cancer for over a year, playing shows to a great extent as he continues to get his solidarity back. He also recently facilitated his 19th annual Toby Keith and Friends Golf Classic, where he talked on the state of country music today and his place in it. Keith let the Oklahoman know that he doesn't write as much music as he used to because, as he put it, radio's not going to play it anyway, so there's nowhere to go with it. You can get it, streamed, and you have your fans who'll play it. In any case, as far as getting airplay, what we do and what I made my Hall of Fame living doing, they don't want that. Along these lines, you're kind of wasting your time. All those years of owning it and being that person where you just put it out and they'll automatically play it. Indeed, not even one of us are that person anymore. Indeed, even the new individuals don't seem to last as lengthy. They come and go pretty quick because it's flavor of the month stuff. And if you thought Keith was gonna change to appease the current day sound of country radio, think again. I've simply never been that person, and I'm not going to change and write that kind of stuff. Yet with all the songs we got, I could play four hours of straight hits. I think we can all agree that country music radio is making a bit of a turn for the better with the success of Luke Combs, Morgan Wallen, Lainey Wilson, Cody Johnson, John Party, and more. However, it's sad to know that Keith's days of running country radio are probably over for good. Gracious Toby Keith is back all right. The big dog daddy has been battling stomach cancer for over a year, revealing the diagnosis last June while canceling his other scheduled 2022 shows. And over the course of the last year, the country star has largely remained out of the public eye. In any case, you can't hold a cowboy down for extremely lengthy. The singer's representatives recently told Fox News Digital that Toby is feeling good and that they are anticipating Toby will be on the road again soon. And Toby himself advised the Oklahoman recently that he's ready to try things out to check whether he's up to getting back in front of an audience. I have more wind. And I'm thinking about bringing the band in and setting up, playing a few days somewhere to check whether I can get through two hours. All I gotta do is check whether I can get through a few nights of work and get a little break in this chemo and we'll return to work.